the world quickly went insane as the first close-up of Archie's face appeared on Instagram. Posting of the Sussex royal family Instagram for Father's Day, Meghan and Harry wrote Happy Father's Day and I wish the Duke of Sussex a very happy first Father's Day. In the photo, Archie is seen holding Prince Harry's finger in his tiny palm, and his hair appears to be quite light and probably red. Rejoice! Little Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor has shown his face at last. Royal enthusiasts cheer. But will you be surprised to know the truth about this picture? What could have possibly gone wrong? Watch the rest of the video as we show you the shocking news behind the first picture of the son of Harry and Meghan. Archie was granted the right to use Prince Harry's senior subsidiary title, Earl of Dumbarton, as a courtesy at birth and by tradition as the heir apparent to their father's Dukedom of Sussex, Earldom of Dumbarton, and Barony of Kilkeel. The Duke and Duchess reportedly preferred that Archie be addressed as Master Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor because they wanted him to become a private citizen as he grew up. Due to letters patent issued by King George V in 1917, Archie had the right to use the titles Prince and Royal Highness upon the ascension of Charles III as the son of the monarch. Since not all members of the royal family who are eligible for a title choose to use one, sources stated that it was uncertain whether he would utilize that title in style. The Duchess of Sussex stated that she had been informed that adjustments would be made to abolish that entitlement in the Oprah interview with Meghan and Harry. Charles III had been considering a smaller royal family since the 1990s. On March 9, 2023, the royal family's official British website was changed to include the phrase Prince Archie of Sussex. According to his parents, any titles would only be used in formal contexts and never in casual discussions. Eleven days after the arrival of Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor, the royal tyke's birth certificate was released and a mystery was solved. Brace yourselves, baby Archie was born in a hospital. Unbelievable we know, as tut-tutting royal correspondents had previously conjectured the eighth great-grandchild of Queen Elizabeth II did not come in a bathtub at Frogmore Cottage on the grounds of Windsor Castle. Archie was actually delivered on March 6 in the early hours of the morning at Portland Hospital, an upmarket private medical facility in London's Westminster district that is owned by Americans. The specific where and how surrounding the birth of the son of Prince Harry and Meghan, Duchess of Sussex, had been a matter of great interest because of few reasons like the palace sent a warning to Harry and Meghan saying they had personally decided to keep the plans around the delivery of their baby private. So royal observers started to panic. This went against recent protocol established by Prince William, Harry's older brother and his wife Catherine, Duchess of Cambridge, who dutifully had their three heirs in the maternity wing at St. Mary's Hospital in London, and then made an appearance a few hours later to pose for photos with the newborns in front of the world's cameras. There was one other cool thing about the birth certificate. It lists the mother's name as Rachel Megan, Her Royal Highness, the Duchess of Sussex, and then for occupation, Princess of the United Kingdom. But what was the shocking news about baby Archie? A photo that was circulated online and purported to be of Archie Harrison, the infant to the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, has been shown to be, your guess is as good as mine, a hoax. The image shows an adorable baby with red hair posing on a bed while wrapped in a green blanket, and was even shared on a Twitter page claiming to belong to Prince Harry and Meghan, despite them never announcing an official Twitter account, although they do have their own Instagram account. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex hope everyone enjoys these new photos of Archie as much as they do. The caption that accompanied the image read, The infant is really the newborn son of German fitness celebrity Bella Krauss, who released the picture of her son Maddox Nino on her Instagram page, contrary to what many fans had assumed after finally getting a decent look at the new royal baby. When fans realized they had been duped by the image, one expressed disappointment and said, so this isn't actually Archie? Another person said the baby is very adorable but the royals would never wear a green wrap and the composition of the photo is completely off. I have no doubt that his adoring parents will be holding him in the image. What a gorgeous baby though. But do you think Archie really deserves the title of Prince? Let us know your thoughts in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe.